Kaidan, Japanese ghost story, a badger. On Akasaka Road in Tokyo, there is a slope called Kinokunizaka. Before the era of street lamps and rickshaws, this neighborhood was very lonesome after dark, and belated pedestrians would go miles out of their way rather than mount the Kinokunizaka alone after sunset, all because of a mujina, or a badger, that used to walk there. The last man who saw the badger was a merchant. This is the story as he told it. One night, at a late hour, he was hurrying up the Kinokunizaka when he noticed a woman crouching by the moat all alone and weeping bitterly. He exclaimed, approaching her, Tell me what the trouble is, and if there is any way to help you, I shall be glad to help you. But she continued to weep, hiding her face from him with one of her long sleeves. He asked again, as gently as he could. She rose up slowly, but turned her back to him, and continued to moan and sob behind her sleeve. He laid his hand upon her shoulder lightly and pleaded. Then that woman turned around and dropped her sleeve and stroked her face with her hand. He saw that she had no eyes or nose or mouth, and he screamed and ran away. On and on he ran, and at last he saw a lantern, so far away that it looked like the gleam of a firefly. It proved to be only the lantern of an itinerant soba seller, who had set down his stand by the roadside and he flung himself down at the feet of the soba seller, crying out. The soba seller asked him, Here, what is the matter with you? Anybody hurt you? Robbers? The terrified man said, I, 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 saw, I saw a woman by the moat, and she showed me. Was it anything like this that she showed you? Cried the soba seller, stroking his own face which therewith became like an egg. And simultaneously, the light went out. <laughs>